What's good, everybody? It's Bike Hacker here. It's out here and it's uh, looking at the water and everything. I will say that that's um, <clears throat> one benefit of living in Seattle is that it's a lot of spots to catch the mountains, the water, and see, like, you know, some green trees and all that other kind of stuff. So that's cool, I guess. But anyway, that ain't what I wanted to talk about. I'm just sitting up here thinking, man. Like, uh, I feel like the more and more that I go out, it's become just like <laughs> a whole like interesting thing. Like today's you know the Fourth of July weekend, and you know obviously a lot of people had the extended weekend wanted to go out and party and stuff. One of my homies is actually his his birthday. Uh, but for me, man, like, I just have not been motivated to go out and kick it at all lately. And I'm not trying to be a lame or anything, because, like, I love to have fun. I mean, shit, I love to turn up and do that kind of shit still a little bit. But at the same time, man, it's like I've just been very conscious about where I've been putting my energy at, man. So I've been noticing, like, you know, when I go out... Like, I don't like having bullshit conversations with people. Like, I'm the person that always ends up, like, dragging people into, like, the deepest conversation that they've probably had all year in, like, 10 minutes, right? <laughs> so, it's like I got to be careful sometimes, babe, because, you know, I just, you know, I'm not trying to change nobody's mind about shit. Let's be clear here. I'm not no preacher no more. I used to be, obviously, if you look back further on my videos and shit, but... Um, that's not my shit no more. Like, honestly, I'm just here to experience my life and uh, live the collective consciousness of other people. And maybe spark that fire in somebody else or some of y'all that's watching this shit. You know, honestly. But it's not to, you know, be pushing views on people and shit. And that's what's so annoying. Like, I was talking to... Uh, some people when I was out yesterday and the topic of, you know, are you vegan or uh, not? Or, you know, do you still eat meat and shit like that? And, you know, people automatically go to a what's good or bad. And, you know, I feel like any anytime you do that, you automatically just like set yourself up to make a shitty decision because good and bad is always relative to the person. So... Um, you know, what's good for you may be good for you, but it may not be good for the next person. Um, so I think that even when that topic came up, you know, I was just telling people it all decide, it depends on what you want to accomplish in life and your experience. Like, obviously, if you eat clean, you know, the cleaner you eat, the higher you can vibrate, the clearer you can think, uh, the less disease that you have in your body, all that other kind of stuff, which is going to benefit you. Um, if you are trying to stay here for a longer period of time, if you want to, you know, experience life in other dimensions while you're here, because y'all soon gonna find that out. <laughs> but, uh, you know, if that's all the kind of shit that's for you, man, like, then do that. But if you came here to party, kick it. You know, if you came here to uh, not even really just say something that extreme, but like if you just came here to do earthly shit and accomplish earthly goals and or even if you just came here and just wanted to fucking just spend a short time here and turn the fuck up as much as you could in the first 21 years of your life. I mean, who the fuck am I to tell you not to eat a fucking burger? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So, but everybody want to be a preacher sometimes, man. Like, and that's the thing is. Um, at least what I realize in myself, man, is that I can't be, like, talking to motherfuckers and just wanting to change their mind or change their heart. Or, and then when they change their mind and their heart, that's how I reaffirm within my own self that what I believe is to be true. And I think that that's what some of the trap is with Christianity, man. I think that they feel like that they can say something to somebody they change and um, you know they move on and do something else that what they are saying is actually or what they believe in is actually a hundred percent true you know and 
it don't work like that so <clears throat> but anyway i'm just saying like you know when i go out man i just try and uh, be cautious man i think that uh, i just be thinking like on different levels man about what people are actually feeling and actually experiencing when they are talking to me you know what i mean like because i get a it's very it's funny man like people react to me different when i go out now it's like before it was just like i was out just partying and turning up and all that other kind of shit man and like now people just hit me up on like the man what's good man like they see me talking about meditating and all the other kind of shit on my instagram or uh a lot of the positive things that i've just been sharing and just trying to spread and build um in my own life and people just been fucking with it so i think that that's also kind of a little bit of a motivator for me to get here on youtube again man because i this is like my original community and like this is how like i normally talk like in long form like instagram is just not for me shit like how you gonna sit up here and just say everything i just said in like one minute or stop in every 10 seconds like that's the lamest shit ever but you know it is what it is and uh but <clears throat> i ain't gonna hold y'all too long man but i just wanted to say man we those of us who are on the same frequency man like when we go out and you know i'm wondering like how do y'all like be responding to people man like sometimes i'll be feeling like i should be sharing sometimes i'll be feeling like man i should be saying shit to nobody man because the opinions is just way too crazy or it's like just not even the type of environment that i'm trying to be talking and yelling to people at because that's the thing like how you gonna have an intelligent conversation with like music blaring all in your ears and stuff and I don't know. I'm still trying to figure that shit out. But I don't know. That's why I'm out here by the water talking to y'all. It's much more like feeling fulfilling and like life feeling giving and that's what I've been after and telling people is like, you know, we get to choose the conversations that we have with people. We get to choose like, you know, the way that we feel. And it's just about being conscious in your body and making the decisions that's best for you fuck all that other stuff that people be talking about so anyway it's the first video of mini man i'll holler at y'all later